Good morning everyone, this is MLC Motorcycling and today I'm going to be cleaning pipes of my Kawasaki Versus 650. Uh, me and the boys were having a little discussion the other day and they said, would you make a little video of me doing it? So here I go. Well, here she is, Valerie. I, just a little bit about her, I brought her off a gentleman called Lee uh, in February this year. Uh, Lee was getting on his ears and couldn't really get out of the battle anymore, so I brought her off her. Uh, it comes with all the padniers and everything, but today we'll be doing the front pipes. And here we go. That's what we're going to be cleaning. I to take off the, uh, the guards and the sides and then hopefully get these all nice and sparkly. So, there we go. These will be the products I'll be using today. I'll be using Harpic bleach, not just any bleach though, the 10 times whiter bleach. And when you look on YouTube about cleaning your exhaust, everybody seems to recommend this. So I've done it on the back box and it does seem to work really well. Uh, a little bit of auto song, just to give it a bit of a clean up afterwards. A tough brush. A little jar to put my Harpit bleach in, and I've got some Meguiar's all metal polish for afterwards. I shall also be using some Allen keys and a knee pad because I'm getting on in age and my knees are knackered. Alright, so here we go. So I'll put on my blue latex gloves and on a protection because when you're using this stuff around, you can splash back. So dip it in and give it a good scrape about, let it soak everywhere. As you can see, you do get some nice brown gunk coming off as you can see that so you just get in there agitate all the pipes get it all down and then I'll just leave that on there for 10 minutes and then I shall come back in between and just give it a little scrape and then clean it all off so there we go okay then after leaving the Arpic on for 10 minutes I am now using a microfiber cloth and some warm water to wipe it all down to get rid of any residues of the Arpic bleach but as you can see, the pipes have come up quite nicely. Uh, there's still some bits I'm going to now attack with the auto sol, and hopefully they'll become up even more sparkly. So I'll just finish off, let them dry, and then we'll get onto the auto sol. Okay, right now we're ready. If the pipes are all dry, I'm going to be using the auto seal and a microfiber cloth. So what I'll be doing is putting a bit of this onto the pipe, and then I shall be applying it gently rubbing it in. Now this does require a little bit of elbow grease so I shall continue to do this to try and get the black marks off now and see how we go. Okay so I will come back to you shortly. Okay right as you can see I've done the front pipe with auto cell and you can definitely see there's a definite improvement compared to the back one. It's still got a few little marks on but compared to how it was It took me about 30 minutes to get that pipe nice and clean, so I shall now give the second pipe a good little going over now, and then we'll take it from there. Alright, as you can see, I've now finished with the auto sole, and to be fair, now pretty sparkly. I'm very happy with the way that's turned out. You can see if they're down there. So, just out of curiosity, I am now going to give it a go with the All Metal Maguire's NXT polish. Well, I'm going to have a little drink first, but I shall give it a go and then we can see if there's any difference in the results. So what I'm going to do is just put a bit on the, on the cloth and then I'm going to start rubbing it in, working it through and see how we go. He might not remove anything, it may do, but... We're getting a bit of dirt on the cloth, so we'll get on and give that a go and see how we go. Come on, do that. As you can see, I've done the front pipe with the Meguiar's NXT, and even though it hasn't taken out any more of the pitting, it has made it nice and shiny. So, from a cosmetic point of view, I'll give the obviously do the second pipe and make it all nice and shiny. So, yeah, it didn't take too long to be fair. Just 
uh, ploughed it like the old salt and then uh, polished it in and then wiped off with a nice clean cloth. So yeah, so we'll give the second one a go now. This is the final uh, product. So the NXT Maguire's polish, brought them up lovely. Uh, give them that little bit of nice shiny thing. It didn't quite do anything to the little bit of pitting, but I would definitely still use it after I've used the Ultrasol because it just brings them up real nice shiny. So compared to how they were, these are looking lovely. Not a bad couple of hours work this morning. So there you go. Right then, that's it then, me done for today. A uh, couple of hours of hard graft as you can see. And it's getting nice and sunny, so it's time for a nice gin and lemonade. So until next time, hee hee, take care.